Morning America, how we doing today? Uh, we're out here at the shop again because we got another flashlight review. Yes, I know, another flashlight review. Uh, but it's that time of year, you know, it's getting ready, get, coming close to Christmas, it's time to start buying gifts for people and flashlights, everybody can use a flashlight. So there you go. Just ideas, folks, just ideas. Ideas for flashlight, uh, uh, Christmas, stocking stuffers, there you go. All right, as you remember last, uh, uh, the last video I did was on this one here, the, the little Archer Mini. Okay, well, it's got its big brother, the Archer Pro. All right, right here, Archer Mini and Archer Pro. All right, now, if you remember the Archer Mini was this one right here, we pull it out and that's it right there, okay? This one here, I opened it up already and looked at it, but it pulls out of the thing. It's got the instructions on uh, uh, in the back. It's got a charging cable. Uh, oh, it's got a silica pack too, all right? box little cradle and there she is that's the big brother archer pro all right now what are the differences of these uh basically double the size it's it's almost every spec is doubled okay on the archer mini it had 405 lumens uh shined about 87 feet if i recall let's see here get my glasses on uh 87 meters all right uh, and that's that's being generous let's put it that way okay i don't think it really shined that far it might on a on a meter or something like that but usefulness is probably not quite that long but anyway they say 87 meters this one here is much longer let me look it up real quick open this up let's find the english version here and right here this one says it'll shine um, 1,022 lumen to 134 meters, okay? So uh, 405, is that right? Yeah, 405 lumens, and this is uh, 1,022 lumens, okay? It's just twice the size, it's twice as big. Um, uh, the run times, let's see here, let's compare the run times. On high, it'll run for two, two and a half, almost three minutes. The Archer Mini will. This one here will only run for a minute and a half on high, on turbo, and then it dumbs down for 145 minutes. So that's uh, more than twice the run time on the you know once it dumbs down. Um, the uh, on uh, oh I tell you what oh the Archer Mini only has high and low and a strobe. The Archer uh, uh, Pro has turbo, infinity high, infinity low, and Firefly. Okay. So uh, let's see here, how did that work? Okay, there's, there's turbo, there's turbo, there's high, all the way down to you know almost nothing. And then there's uh, firefly mode. So it goes gradually up, and it blinks, and then gradually back down, okay? And it blinks gradually back up so you can you can pick a spot there on on the uh, infinity however bright you want it okay and the brighter it is the shorter the battery life the the, the, the lower it is the longer the battery life obviously and it also has uh firefly and strobe like the rest of them uh the archer mini doesn't have uh firefly this one does so it, it has a few more few more options on it but the the real test is basically the light itself how, how it shines so i'm going to close the, the door and we're going to shine on the wall here and we'll do that little little uh run through again okay all right we got the door closed and everything and uh there's the wall and the american flag's up on the wall i can't see it right there okay this is the uh archer pro on my right hand, and on my left hand is the Archer Mini. Whoop, dropped it almost. Okay, that's on high. And that's on turbo. You see the difference? American flag up there. See how much brighter it is? All right, it's more of a white light. The, the, the Archer Mini is a little bit of a, a soft light, you know, soft white. Um, uh, natural white or whatever you want to call it and this is a brighter uh, more of a brilliant white okay but uh, you see the difference now the, Ar the archer mini there's low you can barely see it i'm sure and there's high 
okay? And you hit it three times and it goes to stroke. The Archer Pro, that's high, that's turbo, that's high, and you can go infinity low, it blinks, and then infinity high, all the way up, and it blinks again. And it goes all the way back down. You get the idea? And then you, you click it three times and it goes into stroke. All right, let me get the doors open back up. All right, so I hope that gave you an idea of how bright and whatever they are, uh, uh, how they operate and everything. Let me give you a close-up look at it. Here's the Archer Mini again, and it's, well, let me get the tape measure out. I forgot to do this last time. It's uh, just a little over three, about three and a quarter inches long. The Archer Pro is three and three quarters inches long. Uh, the bezel is just a shade over three quarters of an inch, and this one is just a shade uh, about five eighths okay a little bit smaller side by side comparisons on them you see how much bigger they are okay or better yet like that they both charge the same way you unscrew the, the cap the front lid it only goes so far it, it bottoms out there you can't go any farther and there's a USB-C charging port same with this one you unscrew it and it stops you can't go any farther than that and there's a USB charging port right there, okay? Now, the uh, prices on these. The Archer Mini had a sale on Black Friday sale and, and right before Thanksgiving there, before and after, whatever. It was at $21. I don't know if you can still get that or not, but uh, it's normally about 25 bucks, okay? Somewhere in that range. Uh, this one here is right around 40 bucks, 39, something like that. I'm not sure exactly, I'll put it all here. But uh, anyway, what do I think of it? It's better than the Archer Mini, I think. Uh, to me, bigger's better, strong, uh, brighter's better, the whole nine yards, more functions and everything, but it's almost twice the price, okay? So it's, it costs more. Now, uh, do I like it? Yeah, I, I like almost every flashlight. Would I buy this one? You know, if I had 40 bucks sitting in my pocket and I want to go buy a flashlight, I'd buy this one. The T1S or TS1, I keep saying it backwards. It's a T1S or TS1, I can't remember it. Anyway, this is the one I would buy. I like this flashlight better. There's nothing wrong with this flashlight. The good thing about this flashlight though, it does have the, the, thumb, the, the thumb activation. Whereas, you know, and that's the one thing I don't like about these, uh, the, the, the TS1, is the, the button. If, if you pull it out of your pocket and it's dark, you gotta fumble around to figure out where, you know, because there's rubber, let's see, there's the rubbing, rubber charging port on this side, and then there's the button on this side, okay? And when you're in the dark, and or you pull it out of your pocket or, or something, and it's, it's dark out, and you can't see the flashlight, uh, you pull it out, you, you fumble around, and you're feeling for that rubber, and you feel that rubber, and you think that's the switch, and it's actually on the other side. That's the only thing I don't really care for this, this one. It's the, 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 the switch is less than optimal trying to find it. Otherwise, good flashlight, the T1S, TS1, I'm sorry. Um, <clears throat> this one, you know exactly where the button's at. It's on the tail, okay? It's exactly where you want it to be, right here on the tail. That is a good thing. Now, because this has the infinity up and down and everything, I like that. It's kind of like this one has multiple modes. Uh, the the uh, Archer Mini only has high and low and strobe and that's it. So, but it's only 20 bucks or 25 bucks or whatever. So it's a good flashlight. Of these two, of these three, which one would I buy? That one. So I hope you like that video and uh, you can go on Amazon and buy these and I don't make anything from the sales and everything. What I get out of these reviews, I get a flashlight. So, uh, and I get a flashlight that I can give away to friends, okay? My Christmas presents, so. But anyway, so that's what I like about all this. Uh, don't do it all year long. You should usually do it this time of year to get some, some uh, presents to give away to friends. So there you go. Um, that's what these flashlights are really good for. These smaller, cheaper flashlights, they're really good stocking stuffers. So with that, Merry Christmas coming up. Y'all be good, take care, bye.